We got a good video for you guys today. You guys are gonna have to check this out. It is egg cutting. And uh, we got you guys the update on our ARS rack that we finally finished putting together. And it's looking beautiful. So stay tuned. And the results of the poll. And the results of the poll. One lucky one. So Ryan finally finished building the rack and he did a lot of hard work and realized that there was a couple pieces that were broken and so we had to get replacements and they finally came in and now we have a rack. So we'll just show you guys a quick look at what that looks like and inside the tubs. We just today fed the snakes all in this rack and Ryan is going back and forth about where to put the animals in there. So we're gonna uh, reorganize probably two or three times maybe, I don't know. But comment down below, let us know if you guys think we should put all females in here or if we should mix them up or if we should move around anything what would you guys do and how do you guys keep your snakes comment down below also please if you could hit that subscribe button like this video and hit that notification bell it lets us know that uh you guys are really interested in what we're doing so we really appreciate it <music> Clutch is going to be a ripper. Um, <laughs> we got the uh, old jalopy. The jalopy. Do you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> We're cutting a clutch, guys. It's been a while. I'm very excited to have baby snakes. So, got the jalopy, which is the one we got from Miguel. And I feel like if we say everything that's in it after we say the jalopy, it defeated the purpose of shorten the name. But, since this is a clutch cutting, it's a pastel yellow belly, enchi, orange dream, gene X, hip pied. Leopard. Leopard. Dang it. Yes. So much easier to just tick it off in your head when somebody else says it. So this is the sire, the jalopy, the snake we got from Miguel. And uh, he just ate, so we aren't gonna pick him up or anything like that, but yeah, looking pretty good. <laughs> Uh, to an orange dream spider and here is the mother um, she just ate as well and which is great um, but she's also in shed a little bit so orange dream spider so hopefully we can hit some super OD combos possible head pied I'm sure we'll be able to call these in the egg super easy no problem Ben already knows what's in there <laughs> so this one got a little mold a little discoloration some a little concerned about that egg, but we'll see. Let's get into it. So, all right. What do you think? This one? This one? You want to go this one? Yeah, I so say we do that one first. Just get in the, case. Get the uh, possible disappointment out of the way. Just in case it didn't make it. You know? Let's see what we got here. What? It's an all white snake. Look at it. Look at it. They're just a tiny little dots. Oh yeah. wait, that, look at the head. I can't even, where is the head? Way in there. It's full Holy color. Holy crap. No, that's the, the yolk. Okay, then that yolk is fully colored. The only thing I can see here is this. This is like almost yellow with polka dots. Is it alive? It's, oh, it's, it's alive. Twitching. That's great. That's a super OD combo. Like a, a huge super OD combo. I'm done. <clears throat> What's in it? What's in it? <laughs> Tell me. Look at I don't that. Know. That's your only clue right there. Four little polka dots. Five little polka dots. And go. Um, that would be a um, super jalopy. Super Orange Dream, Leopard, uh, there's Sad. probably Fader in there, and, um, man, that thing, oh, That's man. great looking. We will definitely have to show you guys more of that when it comes out of the egg. Hashtag Mold Gold. <laughs> Shout out, Team Billy. 
Team Billy? That's Team Austin. No, no. I'm Team Billy, so that's why I shouted out. Billy, 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 Billy. <laughs> All right, well... That's a, that's a killer. That's a killer right there. So I think uh, anything we get is just going to be gravy. I'll be honest. I was not expecting that. That's got to be like super OD, Enchi, yellow belly, leopard, probably spider because of the little polka dots. Like, oh, yeah, maybe. That's like, that might be, it could be every gene. I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> Because everybody always wants to believe that they got the, you know, all gene animal, but like, look at that thing. Oh, <laughs> and you can see down here. Is that the tail? That's the head. That's the head? I don't know if people can see that. Let me, yeah. uh, let me try to zoom in a little bit. Yeah, it's hard. I mean, you can see it on camera, but I don't know if people at home can tell what that is. All right. Wow. Okay. It's hard. I believe I put this in the genetics calculator and to hit a normal, the odds are like one in 256. I believe that. Yeah. And it obviously to hit the all gene, it's like one in 256 as well. So, oh man, look at this. This one's all yellow. That's another like super OD spider. Yeah, definitely. I can see the spider line there. Wow. That one. Wow. I'm gonna zoom in again. Maybe yellow belly. Oh, it's so patternless, crap. like. Look at this. How are we gonna know? <laughs> we were just talking before about this. Our friend Brian Barczyk does has been doing a lot of egg cutting videos, and uh, he just calls them so quick in the egg, and we're like, yeah. We're gonna have to call up Miguel and ask him to help I do this. You know, when Miguel got the the jalopy ID'd, he said he called um, Justin Gabelka and Ozzy to confirm what the genes were in it. So maybe we'll have to do that too. All right, so that one has a bit more pattern. That's a leopard, yeah. spider, definitely OD. Definitely, I would say pastel probably. Past, yeah. Oh man, these are really cool. They're hard to, uh, hard to call. <laughs> Look how clean that thing is. And then, I don't know what the Gene X is gonna do to any of this, you know? This one may be kinked. You see right there. Oh yeah. It's possible, I suppose. So we'll have to uh, do a follow up on this. Yeah, when you're working uh, with live animals, it's not always the best or perfect, but we're very hopeful. So we'll let you guys know what happened with that one. That one looks beautiful, too. It has the most pattern of any of the ones we've cut so far. Hard time. There we go. Well, that one looks very similar to the last one. Except for, you can see the head. Look, there's a dot on the top of the center of the head. Spider's hitting on a lot of these. Wow. I don't know if that one's super OD, but that one is definitely spider. Yeah, it's not That's super OD. I don't think it will be that dark. Yeah. Like these two, I feel like definitely. Of course, we have to wait until they come out of the egg to really get a great view of them. And then even more so, we wait for the two weeks for them to have their first shed to get a good, another good picture. Hey, that one doesn't look like it's spider. That looks. Oh, oh man. Oh man. So. There's definitely some defects. That's an underbite, for sure. Hmm. Yeah, there is an underbite, unfortunately. Dang it. These are so pretty, too. Well, hopefully they uh, eat well and, you know, so we leopard, can have them as a pet. Leopard combo with OD. Yeah. Man. 
Well, that's a bummer. <laughs> Definitely a couple of uh, concerning things here. Well, we'll have to see how this all works out. We will definitely uh, give you an update. Yeah. And there you go. I'm just gonna cut in here real quick. I wanted to let you guys know about our sister channel, Herp House Rock. It's our podcast channel. It would really mean a lot to us if you guys would go over there and hit the subscribe button over there. Check that out. We have a bunch of really cool people, interesting people that maybe you might not have heard of or maybe that are just like too big to even talk to. So it's really cool. We're having a lot of fun over there. Make sure you guys get over there and like that. I'm going to give you guys a little taste of what we do over there. Um, so Matt had sent two things. Like burn Matt today? <laughs> He had sent an adult pair of uh, Ridley Eye to me. And, you know, I, I'm unbagging these things and they go wild. Absolutely wild. I'm trying to put them in tubs. And I don't know why. I, 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 you would think that I would undo one at a time. But for some reason, I had both knots undone on the two bags. No, and I put them in the same bag. That was, okay, that's what it was. <laughs> Somehow I know I've got two, you know, both at the same time, and they go nuts. And these things are were probably six and a half. Yeah, six and a half, years. seven foot long. Something like that vicious, dude. Absolutely, absolutely. They both shoot in different directions. And normally, when I'm handling one of these, I'll use a hook just to try to avoid taking a shot. You know, get the bag, get them set up. No, there's no chance for hooks. <laughs> they fly out of my hands. I've got both of them just a foot, you know, behind the tail is about all I got to hold them. One shoots over, grabs hold of this arm. At this point, I'm cussing. <laughs> just let it settle the <laughs> down. You know, I'm, I'm trying to open tubs with my feet while I've got a hold of these two snakes because I don't want them getting behind something. And, and the last thing I want to do is go, man, I received the snakes. I've already lost one. You know, it's... <laughs> Maybe I'll find it in a few days. So this goes on for literally almost five minutes of me wrangling these snakes because, you know, I'm a professional, right? Yeah, yeah. I, this all the time. I got this. So I take one hit on one arm. I'm dodging another one that pops up, shoots past my face, continuing to throw a fit through every bit of it. Finally, after five minutes, I get one in, close, concentrate on getting the other one off my arm, get that in, close, take a breath, turn around, and there stands my wife. She had come down and stood there silently mm -hmm. for five minutes watching me look like <laughs> a rest of these two snakes that are making me just look like a child. I think at one point I'm even going, if you will just go in the cage, I will leave you alone. Just go in the cage, I will leave you alone. I'm having full-on conversations, like trying to logic this snake. Into settling its ass down. So, I think that's about the only one I can come up with off the top of my head. Note to self: Do not put two Ridley Eye in the same bag. <laughs> you can put them in there. Don't be the one who has to take two Ridley Eye out of the same bag. That's the problem. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we appreciate all of your guys' comments and uh, support, and text messages, and uh, all the things, the Instagram messages, all that stuff. It's been really great. And we appreciate you guys watching this video. So if you could, you know, if you didn't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. It really helps us out. Smash the like button. Yeah. So these eggs, Ryan, you know. Yeah. Happy to have eggs. Happy to have the season rolling. We waited a long time to start, you know, it was a late season. But, um, you know, we'll see how it goes. There's ups and downs and we'll bring you along the way. But uh, really happy that, you know, things are moving. So. Yeah, and we got some really great combos with these ones. So we'll see what happens, uh, what they look like once they come out of the egg. Stay tuned for that. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hey, everybody. Let's cut some eggs. <laughs> I feel like there was a good flow there. I feel like they had it. Give me a cut. Give me a cut. Cut, Cut me off a little piece of that. Ball, ball python egg. egg. That was a good one. Uh, I'm bouncing. All right, everybody. <laughs> hey, Dr. Neek. It's Whisper Quiet. 
Guys, I'm super excited. <laughs> it's funny to me, in my head, I'm like saying that, and I'm like... Woo, doggy! I apologize. This, this is gonna be a ripper. This clutch is gonna be a ripper. Um, <laughs> so, uh, five eggs. You know, they all are alive, and um, we will give you guys updates on what they look like, and if there's any issues we have, and... You know, we won't hide any of that from you guys, so...